Hello and welcome to Story New. Today we will see one of our greatest application. This application will allow you to build your Android app easily. Building an Android app has never been easier. But with this application, App Builder, you will be able to build your app in no time. First, you only need to have a store in Story New. Then go and click on applications right here after that go down and click on new apps you will be redirect to the market apps of story new now we are in the market apps of story new at the first you will see app builder application click on it like this then you can easily go down and select your language then click get the app and follow the process of installing the application. When you install the application in your store, go directly to application and you will find it here. Click on activate, then your application will be activated like this. After that, you need to go to business.story.com slash stores slash builder. In the middle, you will see that you have a preview of your app and you can control everything in this app including the home collections the account the orders the splash screen the login screen the register screen forget password screen wish list shop details cart checkout these are all the settings that you need to build your app let's start with the home as you see the home is now displaying my products from my store so for example, let's start with these settings. In the left panel, you will see all the sections that you have in your application. Home, collections, account, order, splash, all of these. But in the right side, you will see all the settings available for that section. For example, the home section, those are the settings available for it. If you click collections, you will see the settings has been changed. Okay, let's start with the home. At the top, we have the app bar. You can see here the app bar. Click on this plus icon right here and all the settings will be shown. First of all, the color of this app bar. You can change the color easily just like this. For example, let's change this to light blue and also the shadow colors. Then you can also set the height of this app bar either you want it to be a small height or you can increase the height of it like this also the radius top you can increase the radius of the top bar or decrease the radius of it the same thing with the icons available in the top bar you can add icons if you click on this plus button right here you can add account shop and cart icons now i have the search in the wish list icon if i click add and select account you will see that the account button has been added and i also can change the color of these icons like this and change also the size of these icons the next thing is the title as you see here this is the title of my store in story new but you can also change this title, for example, Welcome to App Builder. But it's a long sentence. So let's see just App Builder. Or let's see Welcome, like this. Good. Also, you can choose the type. Either you can select the logo or you can select a text, as you see right here. Then choose the color of this text. I will leave it as it is also the style large normal medium and also the font you can control all these stuffs right here beside that you can choose the type of your search either cached or fixed depends on the things you like in your app this is about the app bar if you finish the settings of of any section right here just click on this minus button right here then you can go to the next settings now we are in the card products or the products right here 
you can either choose a fixed height as you see right here and also you can increase the border radius of the products shape as you see also the padding like this and it is really easy to customize then you can also choose the shadow and its opacity for example if you want to increase the opacity of the shadow like this and choose the color of the shadow as you see then the wishlist button we have here the wishlist button you can change its color and you can either activate it or deactivate it i will deactivate it for now also the ratings the row as you see if you click on the right and right here you can choose the color you can activate the rating as you see right here also then the row if you click the green button you will have the sell price the compare price and the total price you can change the colors and the style of these also you can activate them or deactivate them as you see i have deactivated the sell price you can change its color for example to blue like this and you can also edit its style to medium for example or large it depends on what you want that's it for this uh, card product you can also add any other sections in this app for example if you click on this button right here you can add any other sections if you click on the first button up here you will see there is slider collections banners a specific products you can also add them to the home screen for example if you want to add the collections as you see you can add the collections to the home page like this and if you want the collection for example to be up just click on this blue arrow right here and the collections will be the first thing to be shown the same thing like this for example if you click on the collections right here we have you can activate or deactivate this text collections you can either for example put cutty categories for example it depends where you want the style the color also the font you can change all of this also the height and the weight of the card also the height and the weight of the card as you see we always have a live preview of any edits we are doing also the columns here we have type columns you can choose background image you can choose simple like this i prefer background image also you can change the background color air disable it as you see right here the radius of the card depends on what you like the radius image also the background color image you can change that you can disable it or activate it with all of these stuffs it's really easy to customize you don't need to have you don't need to know a lot of stuffs either to build your app using the app builder now we have this plus icon right here and the other plus icon so the other plus icon it is related to these products right here you will see now that i have rating and a price then the compare price also but i can add the name the quantity as you see and i can add also add to cart button and i can add another row like this it depends on what i want in this application this is about the home screen you can also do the same thing with the collections the account the order the splash the login it's the same it's almost uh, the same settings that you're always doing changing the color the fonts and all of that so you could have a really unique application you can also click save config like this and all your configurations in settings will be saved and if you want to build your application directly just click on build app and give this app a name for example my store name in here then you can put the icon of this application right here choose it from your files then put your first name last name and also the password the city the province country code organization and also package name then click on build and your application will be built thank you for watching if you have any questions we still have a lot to discuss about this builder and wait for us in further videos thank you for watching and see you soon in other tutorials